Hello, hello, hello. My name is Kevin Owasu Utoy. I am the creator, the founder of teachyourselftestautomation.com. Today we are teaching ourselves how to handle a calendar in Selenium Web Driver, right? This is proving to be a big uh, subject to handle at once, right? So we're gonna, I'm going to handle the first part of it, which is showing you how to select the current date, right? And then I'll have subsequent videos about that, which I'll put on my YouTube channel, okay? And you can check those out, right? So choosing the month and choosing the the month, the date, and just the current, not the current date, but the actual date, right? It's different. So selecting current date to selecting any of the other dates is quite tricky and different. So I'll keep those videos elsewhere, okay? So today we are showing you how to select current dates. Not showing you, I have learned it, so I'm showing you how, how I do it. And uh, hopefully that you find this bit valuable, okay? Sorry you had a video from me for a while. Thank you for sticking in with sticking in here with me. Um, and thanks to all those who subscribed. Don't forget if you find this valuable, subscribe, click the bell icon, and they'll be notified when I receive release videos on any of the topics that I'm teaching myself with Selenium WebDriver and Java. Okay, so here we go. Let's dive into Eclipse and try and write our code, right? The website we're going to use today is Path. To USA so this one right so we're gonna to go to the date field so current date is highlighted right current date is usually highlighted so you want to expect inspect it so today is the 24th when you inspect that now if you look at the code right so those are the, that's a code but all the different the other different days right if you highlight or if you hover over the other dates you see it's highlighted there right so the 22nd the 23rd and the 24th so the 24th is the current date right and if you look at that closely we have an extra class name which is called active day right active day so and there's no active day there's no extra class field for uh, the other days right so the current day always has an extra value for the class attribute right so we want to use that extra value for that class attribute which is unique to current day and that's the, the, the value we're going to use to select our current date okay so hopefully that makes sense if it doesn't make sense check out my blog as well okay so right let's dive into um eclipse and we we'll go for it okay so we we'll right click on our project folder new class right and we we'll call this current date okay and then we click on public static void main i want to dive over to any other script we've already done we take our three common lines of code and you should notice by now which is uh, yeah so we want to replace the url in here with the url of our our uh, live practice which is this live practice url we're going to put this in here now the action we want to carry on first right so when we visit this let me refresh that when we visit this this is the default right so the action we want to carry first is clicking into the date field right so that's the first action so that the calendar can be displayed right so that's straightforward right on this occasion i've been using xpath for quite a while right so i'll be showing you how to use a css right so we right click and we inspect so i'll get our html code for that field so now if we look into here and look for a class right look for class right so that's a class value so if we copy that now i've got another tip for you right if you want to change a class value into a css all you have to do is to put a dot in front of the class value right so i'll show you how to do that now so as we've highlighted our code and we're in the developer uh, tool, we click Control F to get our our tab open down here, right? So in here, all we want to do is put a dot in front of our class value, 
and with any space we want to take away the space and put a dot right now you see it's highlighted our HTML uh, code for, for our attribute which is our date travel field okay so we want to keep this because that's what we're going to use to click into this field right so let's go and write that code right now oops sorry about that Wanted this one so we go driver dot dot find element by css selector and in here we want to place our code right place our code and then we go dot click so that's also now clicked to display our our um, calendar right so we have displayed the calendar now now we want to select the current date now we've already inspected the current date and you saw the extra uh, class value right of current i mean of uh, active day so we want to copy the active day we want to do it exactly the same thing so we go dot active day now because there's a space in between active and day it will not highlight so we want to take away that space and put a dot in between right now we see one for one so that's unique right so one for one down here so that's unique we want to copy this this and we want to write our line of code to actually select current date okay so we go driver dot find so we want to find by css css selector open and close brackets in there open and close double brackets so in there you place our css and then you say dot and it's as easy as that right so we want to run this so what's going to happen is we're going to click into the date field the calendar is going to open and then we're going to select current current date right and that's it simple so as i said um, we'll find out how to do select the day other days other than the current day and how to select the month right it's proving a bit tricky so i'm doing that in separate videos which i'm going to keep on my youtube channel okay but this video i'm going to put on top of my blog okay Thank you very much and let's run this and find out okay if it works or not right it's just been a bit slow here we go you ready for that right it's launched it so if it clicks on the date field date of travel it's going to be fast so here we go still loading still loading there we go right click very fast and selected 24th of december remember that was our default date 24th of december not current date that this uh, actual calendar has a current date of 24th of december 2019 okay so don't get confused so that's our, that's the default i don't you know i don't know if it was from this calendar but as a default for that site okay so thank you very much for watching again if you found this um, helpful in any way subscribe to the channel uh, show some support show some love comment and uh, click the bell icon to be notified when i release videos okay so that you can follow through right or follow along so to speak right so thank you again for your engagement thank you for your subscriptions and uh, yeah let's uh, let's 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 fall in love with what we do right so that our job becomes our passion or our job becomes our craft okay that's what we're aiming at right so test analysis you know let's get some support see you later